Alright, what's good YouTube? And I gotta say before we even start, if you guys keep watching these hip-hop videos, I'm never going back to what I was doing. But, anyway, the BET Awards was yesterday, and uh, not a lot of big names that I wanted to see in there, but there was a couple. Um, big Wax, I've been a fan of him for since 2011, not that long. Um, I'm not gonna pretend I was watching him since like 2009 or something, but I heard uh, Scrub Life, and it was really good. So I've been a fan of his, so I was looking, real, uh, looking forward to it, and it didn't disappoint. Um, if you don't know what his channel is on YouTube, it's um, Wax and Herbal Tea. Um, quick shout out, really cool dude. Um, he responds to fans a lot, which is pretty cool. Um, he just doesn't ignore everybody and just say fuck you like a lot of a, a lot of rappers do. Ugh. But um, anyway, what he did do though, his quick verse was really good. I enjoyed it. Um, of course, he's really good. One of the one of the better rappers uh, out right now. But let's talk about some of these other guys, right? And let, let's cover this Kendrick thing, all right? Because a lot of people are saying, oh, Kendrick's dissing everybody. Oh, he's dissing Drake. Cry, cry, cry. That's a good thing. I don't know if you guys ever noticed this, but when when rappers get into beefs, when, when diss songs happen, right? Some of the best music is made. And I don't know if you guys know who Army of the Pharaohs is. If you don't, go check them out. Shout out once again. And, um, <coughs> and Army of the Pharaohs, right, is like a collaborative group of like um, some of the best MCs that you'll ever hear. And when they really want to do good, you know, their music, their writing ability raises up just like in, um, in rap beefs, right? You want to outdo the other person, so your writing skill comes up, better songs, better lyricists, you're out of that. So, when people get into all these disses and people are like, ooh, ooh, no, you know, I mean, it's not good if you have some, like, East Coast, West Coast type thing, diss, that's not what I mean. What I mean is, is if you just have, like, you know, a one-on-one -on -one with a person, but it's cool, you know, you're cool with the dude, but you just kind of want to outdo him, like Kendrick did in his control verse, which I liked, because, you know, it upped the whole spirit of hip-hop, and it just brings everybody up as a whole. So, uh, at that, now that that's out of the way, Kendrick Lamar killed it, um, pretty much everybody in that, in his little group there killed it, um, not really a fan of any of those dudes, I'm not even really a fan of Kendrick, but he's dope, I don't, I'm, I don't say he's garbage or whatever, um, I just, he's not my style, so... Same thing with like people like Joey Badass and stuff. They're all good, don't get me wrong, but just not my style. So, uh, Slaughterhouse. Royce to 5'9", Crooked Eye are two of my favorite rappers um, of all time, right? Royce to 5'9", of course, and Crooked Eye killed the verse. They all killed it, right? But Crooked Eye killed the whole thing. The whole thing. Um, like he did with that one. I don't know if it was 2011 now or 2012, but uh, the last cypher he did on BET, I'm pretty sure it was 2012, but anyway he killed that one as well so that's no surprise um but slaughterhouse as a and a lot of people were disappointed with the album i was and i thought it was really good but um i don't know whatever little kim came out looking like a cat like a frog uh, oh man i don't even know what i can say about little kim man why why ruin it she was already pretty right and then she had to go and do all i don't know why people feel the need to go and get all this plastic sir don't do it don't do it like Nicki minaj and her nose thing don't do it just leave it alone leave it alone right but you know it is what it is in the end there um i liked it man i thought everybody killed killed it the whole asap mob they did their thing once again not a fan of those guys either but uh nobody did bad nobody was like oh god damn this guy again he's coming out of nowhere you know like we didn't have no soldier boy bet verse we didn't have any garbage and uh so overall pretty good so anyway if you guys like the video don't forget to hit it with a like and subscribe for more hip-hop every day and i'll see you guys later peace